First off, I just want to start off by saying clearly I am a football mastermind. I predicted 12 out of the 15 games. Now, 15 out of 15, I got three wrong. I will be honest about that. But 80% score is a pretty great average to have when you're picking teams. Clearly, I know what I'm talking about when we're talking football. More than some experts, I'm a genius. Just look at this. How can you tell me I'm not a genius? None of you expected it. I didn't expect it. People probably call me crazy for picking the Ravens over the Chiefs, but literally, I knew what I was doing. Stop the cap. <laughs> Okay, maybe maybe I didn't know what I was doing. Welcome back to another week of NFL Pick'ems. This is going to be week three of NFL football. Before we get into it, I'll ask you guys to like, share, and subscribe. We're on the road to 100 subscribers, and I can't wait to hit it. So let's get on with the video. This week might be a little bit more difficult because I didn't really have all week to look straight into the teams. I only had a few days. So some of these picks might sound insane to you, but... To me, it's the correct pick. I know what I'm doing. I'm a football expert. So let's just get on with this. So first teams, we have Carolina Panthers versus Houston Texans. Uh, I actually put Texans beforehand, but I'm going with the Panthers. Last week, I didn't, and I regretted it. I found out that they have Sam Darnold, Christian McCaffrey, and that team is nasty. Uh, the Texans, they got some new quarterback. I don't know who he is, but he did get a win. So, All right, Bills versus Washington football team. I believe... In what's his name? Heine, Heine, Heineke, Heineke. That's his name. <laughs> I think that's his name. So I'm gonna go with the Washington football team over the Bills. Why? I don't know. I, I think the Bills, I don't remember if they won or lost, but I'm going with the Washington football team. Chicago Bears versus Cleveland Browns. Hmm. I didn't go with the Chicago Bears last week and they disappointed me because they actually won. But this week, I'm still not going to go with them. We are going with the Cleveland Browns. Baker Mayfield, he's going to kill it. I think they have Odell Beckham coming back soon. I'm not too sure. Pretty sure he is. So that's going to be pretty fun once he comes back. Ravens versus Lions. I'm not even going to think. The Ravens, bro, they destroyed the Kansas City Chiefs with the run game. All they did, Lamar Jackson, fake pass. Oh, Lamar Jackson runs the ball. First down. Oh. And then everyone started going crazy because the Ravens beat the Chiefs in week two. I wasn't even surprised that my prediction was right. I thought I was going to get it wrong, but I actually got it right. So a little bit of a football genius, as you could say. So next up, we're going to go with the Indianapolis Colts versus Tennessee Titans. Now, this is going to be a weird one because the Titans, I watched that game. They won in overtime against the Seahawks. It was a pretty eh win. Their offense didn't seem too good. Their offense was a little bit shaky. Their offense is basically just turning into give the ball to Derrick Henry and get out the way. That's literally what's happening. And the Indianapolis Colts are 0-2. So, Pat McAfee needs to come in there, kick a field goal, because clearly that's what they're lacking. Now, I'm going to go with the Indianapolis Colts. Why? When your team starts off 0-2, your third game, you're going to come out blazing. It happens in the NBA all the time. Teams start off 0-3, 0-4, and they blow out a team in their next game. Maybe that doesn't happen in football, but I'm going with the Indianapolis Colts this week just because they're 0-2, and they got their quarterback, uh, Carson Wentz. And last week, he played okay, I guess. Chiefs versus Chargers. I want to go with the Chargers, but I'm going with the Chiefs. They lost last week. I doubt they're going to lose any more than three games in the season, so I'm going with the Chiefs. Saints versus Patriots. This is one of the more even picked matchups. The Saints, they they really disappointed me last week. So I'm gonna go with the Patriots. Because look, Jameis Winston, maybe old Jameis Winston is back. I don't know. Jameis played a pretty bad game, and that game in Carolina was just horrible. So I'm not gonna pick them again this week. I'm gonna go with the Patriots. Falcons versus Giants. 0-2 matchups. This is complete trash. Okay. So Falcons versus Giants. I'm gonna go with the Giants because they got that um Sa Saquon Barkley. The dude has some huge legs. Yeah, we're going with Saquon. I mean they almost won, but they lost to a field goal and Heineke <laughs> made an insane comeback. I watched that game. So Bengals versus Steelers. I'm not even gonna think it twice. I picked the Bengals last week and they failed me completely. Not doing that again. Jaguars, Poverty Franchise pff, versus Cardinals. Cardinals are taking that. Jaguars, I don't know what the hell is going on. Urban Meyer said it's so hard to win games in the NFL. 
Bro, you are off to a horrible start already. I mean, you had Tim Tebow on your team for crying out loud. Broncos versus Jets. We're going with the Broncos. The Broncos, I don't know who's their quarterback. I just know that they're playing pretty good. Now, Dolphins versus Raiders. Um, Dude, I don't know what's going on in Miami. I know Tua got injured, and they got blown out. They didn't even score last week. So I'm going to go with the Raiders. The Raiders are looking really good. And that was one of those picks that I got wrong last week. So I'm going to have to go with the Raiders. Rams versus Buccaneers. My favorite team versus my favorite team style. I mean, I'm literally wearing the hat. I bought this. I bought the hat this week, but it's still a pretty cool team. So I'm going to have to go with the Buccaneers. The reason why is the Rams really struggled against the Colts. I don't know why they did. I mean, Jalen Ramsey still took that intercept. I'm, I'm talking crazy. I don't even know if he did. But the Rams, they played pretty good last week, but they struggled against the Colts, and they struggled to stop their offense. Now, I will say the Colts have a pretty good offense, but I was a little bit disappointed. And Tampa lost to the Rams last year, so I think this year they're really going to bounce back. Our offense looks insane. So Seahawks versus Minnesota Vikings. Seahawks are taking it. The Seahawks lost last week, so... That's why I believe that that's why I believe that the Seahawks are going to win this week since they lost last week in such a close game to a good opponent and the Vikings are complete trash. That's just how it is. Packers versus 49ers. This is an extremely rough one. I want to pick I want to pick Aaron Rodgers. So it's Aaron Rodgers versus um Joey Garoppolo, I think that's his name. That guy sucks. No one likes him. So I'm going with the Packers. <laughs> Now, Cowboys versus Eagles, inner division matchup. I'm going with the Cowboys, bro. I already told you last week, I'm never going to pick the Eagles to win a single game because they're just ugly. If you're an Eagles fan, I'm sorry. I have nothing against you, but their logo is just so trash. And this week, I'm going to submit my picks just so that I can have a hard copy and just so that I can look at the picks once it happens and it can tell me right or wrong and I don't have to have this little list like I did this week. So those are my picks for this season. Let's recap. Let's recap. So we got Panthers, Washington, Browns, Ravens, Colts, Chiefs, Patriots, Giants, Steelers, Cardinals, Broncos, Raiders, Buccaneers, Seahawks, Packers, and Dallas Cowboys. Maybe if I get five wrong, that'll question my Pickham's expertise and maybe you won't trust in me anymore. But look, one certified win I can give you is that I know for a fact my Buccaneers will help me beat, beat the Rams. That's all I got to say. Yeah, maybe I can't name the whole starting lineup, but I know my team is going to win. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. That's going to be week three of the NFL Pick'ems, my picks, and the picks that are going to win you $1,000. You'll be like that guy, but he bet on the Lions. I bet on the Packers, and clearly my pick would have gotten him the $750,000. So follow along with me, and you're going to win money. I'm not actually a Pick'ems expert because this is kind of hard. So that's going to do it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I truly do appreciate all the love and support you constantly give me. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Hit the bell to be notified every time I upload. Roll to 100 subscribers, and I'm out of here. See you next time.